All new for 2018 is the Volkswagen Tiguan. This is the SEL 4 motion model. You can get LED daytime running lights standard and on the premium model, adaptive LED lights. The fog lights actually have a cornering ability to them for better visibility. What do you guys think of this orange color? It's pretty unique. You can get 17 to 19 inch wheels depending on the trim. We have 18 inch here. We get LED tail lights. The Tiguan gets a little bit sporty with this wide dual exhaust. I think it looks pretty nice on this vehicle, pretty slim. The rear cargo space actually grew by 30%. With a two row model, you have 73.5 cubic feet. There is actually an available third row seat. And as you can see the lever right here, just an easy lever to fold down the seat so you don't have to reach in or go through the back doors. This is a really large cargo area for its class and you actually have an option for a hands-free foot activated tailgate. This one is a power tailgate on this model. As we move into the back seat, the back seat does have some nice materials. Looking at the door, it's fairly plain Jane, although it is soft. You do have a bottle holder down below. I do have this second row seat folded down. It is a fairly flat fold. You do get a center folding armrest, rear seat air vents, and a pretty spacious interior overall. Definitely bigger and better than the previous generation Tiguan. In terms of the powertrain, all Tiguans come with a 2 liter turbo with 184 horsepower, 221 pound feet of torque, miles per gallon is 22 in the city, 27 on the highway, 21 in the city with the 4 motion all wheel drive. Those are all paired with an 8 speed automatic and they actually have several settings that you can do with the 4 motion all wheel drive from snow, on road, off road and off road custom. You can get on the premium model you can get memory seats. We do have 10 way power heated leatherette seats. Leather seats are only on the premium model. These leatherette seats still were comfortable. We also have a panoramic sunroof that helps to brighten up this dark interior. Overall, Volkswagen give you, gives you a fairly modern looking interior. It's fairly sleek going across the dash. As we start over on the left, you do get some lighting controls over here. This is actually a leather wrapped steering wheel and it does have steering wheel controls both on the left and on the right side for your information display. The steering wheel actually has a flat bottom which is similar to some sports cars. On high end models, you can actually get a huge 12 inch digital display in the middle. Right here we have an 8 inch touch screen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto that puts out 480 watts in a 9 speaker system. Dual zone automatic climate control is standard on this trim. Down below, I'm sorry it is so dark, but you do get a couple charging ports as well as additional storage in front of your 8 speed automatic shift lever right here. You can have a sport mode. There are your 4 motion controls for the snow, on road mode, etc. The center console is soft to the touch with some cushioning, but it is fairly small in between your arms right here. As we move up, up ahead, you can get an automatic dimming rear view mirror with home link for your garage, but it is not available on this trim level. And here is a look at the huge panoramic sunroof with the shade that you can move forward or backwards. In addition to that, we do have several safety features. Available safety features are front assist with emergency braking, blind spot monitor, rear traffic alert, lane assist, adaptive cruise control, parking sonar, and an overhead camera. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think of this 2018 Volkswagen Tiguan down below. Give it a like, comment, and please subscribe. See you next time.